Jaya Jaya Shiva Rajaya here from vitalcoaching.com. The topic for this video is the art of being super conductive to life. Let's check a little bit what happens when you have an interaction with another human being. Sometimes you are going to meet this person and you notice that they are holding back. There is something in them that is shut down. They are not either trusting you or they are not engaging into a conversation. They are not really opening up. And the reason why they are doing that is because there is there are layers of protection that stop them from actually engaging and going directly into a full open heart connection or conversation or interaction with you. So if you mirror that to yourself, you will realize that in any form of interaction that you have with another human being, there is going to be an exchange of energy. And that exchange of energy is going to create a, a magnificent experience or something that is kind of locked down and held back, depending on how much you invest into the process. So what I want to encourage you to do is realize that when you are holding back, what is, what is happening is that experiences in life is are holding back from you. The more you engage, the more you bring in to the table, the more you commit yourself, the more you embody action and you bring that forward, the more life is going to respond to you. If you want things to happen in your life, positive things to come back to you in your life, you've got to somehow show your face. You've got to engage at least a little bit of time, energy, resources, energetic and emotional resources. So the what happens between uh, two human beings when they are interacting is a good metaphor to what can happen in life in general. If you want to create things, uh, uh, fulfill your mission, go forward in your existence, what you have is to come with a certain energy and bring that forward into your existence, into the, the projects, into the missions that you want to activate in your existence. So on an energetic level, what happens is that we've got an infinite source or potential of energy flowing through us. You know, you heard about Kundalini or Chi or the, the, the Shakti energy is running through you. So when you open up your system, when you really unleash and release your system, you're going to create this vortex of this flow of energy that allows you to be super conductive to life. Super conductive to life, it means that you are radiating out, you are blossoming, you are expanding into this field of energy and that usually feels really good. So here is the advice for you today. Try to see what happens if you have the feeling that things are not, are not coming your way or that you are somehow constricted within the limits of your um, of your energy or what's, what's happening in your existence, try to see what happens if next time you're having an interaction with somebody, you try to open up a little bit more. This doesn't mean that you have to start singing through the streets and be completely joyous all the time, okay? We're talking about something that is a little bit more subtle, but realizing that when there is contraction and you're holding back, life is going to hold back from you. So next time you have an interaction with another human being, next time you're in a situation, in a social situation with being, try to engage in conversation try to be interested, try to invest actually a certain amount of energy into that interaction so that something comes back to you in the exact uh, same way because it's really an exchange of energy. Energy is a currency, it's a current of energy that can happen between two human beings and uh, it's beautiful to be able to play with that at will and master it. I love you, I'll see you soon.